What's going on, everybody? Kenny Dubs here with another Mega Man X Dive offline video. Today, we're going to be talking about the limited time event quest. So, you might have noticed when you come over to the events tab, there is a quest up here that you cannot access as a player level must be level 60. So, in order to unlock them in the first place, you need to be level 60. All right, so I swapped over to my main save file, but I'll include a screenshot here where I'll need level 60. You see level 60 and the show limit time event has been unlocked. Once that happens, you have two options on how to control the events that are unlocked. First is you can come over here to the second uh, second icon up at the top here. Click on this and you have the event settings right here that you can uh, use. The other option is to come over here in the events tab and click on event settings and you can come over here and click on the event that you want to do. Now, this is very important because you can get various rewards from these events. However, this is also where you get the event tickets. Popping over here to the shop real quick, just want to show you here. You see I have 2,000 tickets for our 2,000 event tickets. Again, you get these from doing the events. And if I click on this, you can see here, I can go ahead and just buy whatever I want over here from the seasonal events or from the special events here as well. So there are some cards over here that I can get or coming over to the seasonal events, there are some there are some cards and some characters, uh, such as the summer character like Swimsuit Eco, uh, the New Year's characters like New Year Cinnamon, so on and so forth over here that you can get Halloween characters as well. So now that you've unlocked your event quest, you're excited to go, you're really raring to get into them. So you click execute and after you click execute, you see that you are underpowered because if you go here almost immediately, once you hit level 60, you are likely going to be underpowered. So what does that mean? Well, it means you are going to get destroyed in this stage, most likely. Now, there is a way to circumvent this. As you can see here, I'm underpowered and I sell 2,000 event tickets. How did I accomplish that? Well, for those of you that have played the mobile version of X Dive like I have, you will know about the Maleficent Hero event. And this event is very, very special and unique. The reason for that is, Despite the fact that this stage has a recommended power, the stage doesn't care about that at all. The reason for that is this is the uh, this is one of the event stages with no enemies whatsoever. So you can easily do the stage regardless of what your total power is. You will need to be able to uh, complete the stage in a pretty timely manner and deal a decent bit of hits to certain things. But other than that, this stage is pretty easy. I'm not going to cover this stage in this video. What I will do, though, is show the event rewards that I got. Because I have a screenshot of that from when I was streaming. And I will show the rewards tab here as well. So, you see here, I have 2,000 points. That's just from doing one run, getting S rank. As you can see here, my evaluation is S. And from here, you can see that I can claim these rewards. I didn't claim these because I wanted to claim them for this video. Although, it doesn't really matter all that much. I click collect all, and I get the rewards here. Now, you can see here, there are a few other rewards I didn't get. So in order for me to get these, I would have to run the stage two more times with an S rank for that. And that about wraps up this video. I just wanted to briefly talk about how to get the event tickets, do the event stages, um, specifically this stage, because this stage is very, very easy, regardless of what your power is, you can, so you can start rolling in those tickets early. Uh, something I do want to note though, for the other stages, is that um, they all have different rewards and you'll have to get the points in each, each event stage. So as you see here, the, re the rewards are still 4,500, but I didn't get 4,500 points there. I got the 4,500 points in the Maleficent Hero event. And again, click Execute, and um, 37,000 total power. Uh, I didn't even attempt it because when I initially unlocked it, I was at, I don't know, maybe like one, between 1 to 50,000, 1 to 70,000 total power. So I didn't attempt that. Um, but uh, just so that you can actually see me doing it, because um, I wanted, I kind of want to do that event first, but... Uh, so if I click on Network Guardian, which I have open right now, close it, it goes back into the CVS Com. See that? Now I no longer have Network Guardian here. However, if I want to do, say, um, a special stream of the new year, activate that. And now I can do the special stream of the new year stage. Same for any other stage that I want to do as well. So if I click on special events, let's say I want to do the Faithful Guardian event, activate that. And boom, it is here for me to do. Um, again, you can only do this once you hit level 60, but this is something that I wanted to make note of as well, because I've seen some people uh, having having some questions about where to get the points. Um, and uh, I have seen some things about people being underpowered for the event stages, 
Um, and I guess that's just because they haven't played the gotcha version of X-Dive. But many players that have played the gotcha version of X-Dive will remember the Maleficent Hero, assuming you're playing during that event. And um, yeah, this event is just uh, pretty easy. I might include some clips here of it, um, just going through it. I'm not going to do a whole event coverage in this video. Um, I'll probably do more event coverages uh, later on. Um, but uh, there are videos on my channel of most of the previous events that have gone through. So if you want to watch those before I cover them on this, uh, you can go ahead and find them there. Uh, but yeah, other than that, um, not much else to say. Anyway, hope everyone enjoyed this video. If it did help you out. If it did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Help the channel to go join me doing the content. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Later.